Hello everyone, welcome to Tecaria, Josie Tecard again for the second episode of the Living City Project. My goal with this video is to show you a little bit of teaching along the way and our project can go forward through your game. So in this case, I'm not going to show you that I am good at chopping tree or at building. I'm just going to show you what the advancement have made and make you having a little bit of jumping time. So let's go see my traditional super map so we can see my Tikaria tags here. We having my iron farm four time there and my iron farm one time there. So the goal is these to be linked together and reach this zone is going to be the new storage area that will be all sorted automatically. But to be sorting, I need a little bit of a tricking. So I've been away from Minecraft for a while and I had to learn again a lot with redstone. And it is a lot of fun. And this thing here behind me will allow me to sort my stuff. It's very easy to use. Here how it works. So we're having our chests. We're having our uppers. That have different thing in it. But only gonna let pass the redstone dust. So we're having our torch here. That locks the two center. And the top upper. So in this situation the two there are locked. And the top one is measured and calculated by the comparator. So let's see what's inside. We can see the comparator send a two signal and not three. So if I put more in it, it triggered a signal. So it MC. So let's just try to drop stuff in it. Mm -hmm. If we drop slowly, we'll catch them one after another. But if you drop a lot in one shot, it will just take a little bit of time for it to catch them all. So here it passed so fast we could not see what it is. So let me put a bit more here. You can see the comparator is now sending a three signal. It stopped, it's allowing the two center ones to go down. And when it's no longer the case, poof, the two upper and the center are stopped. So this little tricky circuitry allow anything to be sorted and it's very useful. So I'm back at the map here. I'm going to show you the little section. We have an iron section now and a bone section on where every bone meal and everything will go. The best view to see it from, it's here. On top of my iron golem farm, we can see the two new rooms that I built down there. And this little guy will end up in a new room underneath. So everything will gather there. Let's go there and see what it will be looking like. We are underneath. Here is going to be my little hub. It's not even built yet. The train track will go out. So we can clearly see from here there's going to be a very huge area underneath because I did a giant slab to allow me to not have to dig too much when I'm working for the project. So here's what it looks like under. I'm going to do a quick jump to go straight in the room on top of it. So I am in an iron room. This is going to be the storage. We'll be sorting the iron ear and the rest of it will go into the next room being turned by the composter into bone meal. So no more manual composting. Yay! It is everything for today's episode. I hope you enjoyed it. My video will always be short, but they will contain a lot of new material. It is normal. I love to build and I never stop. Like each of you, I am a fan of this game. Have a great day, everyone. See you next time. Ciao!